Dan the Man here doing another video demo of SNEMUL DS, this time version 0 0.5 beta 2. Now, I wanted to demo Super Metroid here, but I've had some issues getting it to boot correctly. So this is now my fourth time trying to record this video. In any case, aside from a few graphical, is graphical issues and this booting issue, uh, the game is really actually pretty playable. I'm just not sure why it keeps crashing. It'll usually crash right after this point right here. I'll press A. There we go. Success. My goodness, I don't know what's wrong. It was working fine. <sighs> I think my card's corrupted or something. It was working fine the other night, I swear. Anyway, if you press start, you'll notice the map is empty. However, you can go into the graphical config menu, change a single setting, and there you go, it's back. This graphical config menu is very helpful in changing a few settings here and there in order to uh, make games as playable as possible. You'll notice that when scrolling vertically, uh, there's a little bit of lag with the screen updating itself and horizontally as well. Uh, I'm not really sure why this is, but it doesn't detract too much from the experience. And see, it doesn't even happen out here. Only when you're inside this area. Obviously, I'm not too far in this game, but... Yeah, you can see it takes a little, a split second for the screen to update itself. Which kind of makes it look strange, but... It works. That's the main idea. Then, I also wanted to demo... Where is it now? Oh, right, of course. I know I already demoed this one, but because it sounds and looks so much better in this version, I want to show it again. Chrono Trigger, again. No more cracking sound, no more major issues. Well, okay, so you still... It's still a little bit hard to see the text. And again, here... I'm going to go into the graphical config menu and fix that. And I swear I was not making this audio issue a minute ago. I'm just going to go to the Middle Ages here for the heck of it. Just going to give you an idea of what the combat looks like. Again, you'll notice that the text at the top is going to be a little bit hard to read, but it's kind of grayed out, really. It's still very playable, though, uh, more so than SNESI DS, even, so Slot 1 users can now enjoy this game very much. Hmm, that hurt. A whopping 5 HP out of my, what, 897? Yep, good job there. Alright, so, with that out of the way... I'm actually going to reboot for a second, because I think Super Metroid screwed up the sound sync. Uh, the next game was specially requested on a YouTube comment, Axelay, or however you pronounce that. And in fact, it didn't even work that well up until this version, so it was perfect timing, really. And I'm going to try to play the best I can with this viewing angle. Not going to work too well, I realize, but should give you an idea. And that's the whole point of these videos. Darn it! Stupid. Darn it! 
Oh, okay. This area right here was a major issue in previous versions. You couldn't see these enemies. You could see the asteroids once you hit the enemies. But trying to hit them in the first place was the issue. Like right here. Oh, darn it. Yeah, I'm not the best at this game, especially at this viewing angle. But the background has been fixed in this, issue, in this version. So the major problem that was affecting this game is now gone. Yeah, I'm just gonna stop here because that was a that was really sad. And let's see. I believe I had one more game I wanted to show you. Hmm. I should probably work these out beforehand. Yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna go with Super Bomberman, just because I like the game. Now you do have to keep this in no V-Blank mode for it to work correctly. So if no V-Blank ever gets too fast, well, we're kind of out of luck. luck. But, again, this has become much more playable in the recent versions. So, I commend Arcade for that. There we go, got one. Thank you, bomb upgrade. Oh, darn it. Yeah, I still have no firepower, but... There we go. I think this is running a bit too fast. Yeah, it's at 150% right now, but... Yeah. Oh, well, no wonder. There, it's under interrupt speed hack. No wonder. Now it's running at 100. Perfect. I think I would have noticed that before now. It's just playing it this afternoon. Oh, well. So, you get the idea. And that basically concludes this version of my demo. I hope you enjoyed it. And update the stupid compatibility list. I'm tired of being the only one. <laughs> Thanks. Bye.